Hey everybody, sorry it uh, took so long to get this one out. Um, it's been crazy with, with life and work, and I just didn't get to do this as quickly as I wanted to. But anyway, so today's episode is about Season 2, Episode 6 of The Bad Batch. And that episode is called Tribe. So this episode is about a Wookiee that the Bad Batch finds while doing some sort of mission for Sid. Um, and in the end, this Wookiee proves to be he's actually a Jedi and a youngling at that. So he's, he's not a full-grown Wookiee. Um, and, and you don't catch that right in the beginning, but then you get towards the, you know, the end of the episode and you, you kind of catch on from um, the story clues and whatnot that this, this person, this Wookiee, uh, is actually not, not a full-grown adult yet. And so that's, that's, that's actually really interesting to know because then you start seeing him with all the other Wookiees and he's a lot smaller. So this Wookiee's name is Gunji, and uh, so this finds us, uh, they're on that station with the uh, with these droids that are smugglers, and so they're looking to do some sort of transaction with them. It's not entirely clear, it must not have been too important, because we don't really talk about it for the rest of the episode, but we find Gunji, and Omega makes friends with him, and uh, we find out that He's just been trying to return to Kashyyyk. So if you remember, Jedi uh, that are that are brought into the Order are inducted in usually is very, very young. So he has no memory of Kashyyyk. He just knows that he's a Wookiee and that's where his people are from. And he's trying to get home. So but, you know, so he knows from the uh, from Order 66 that clones can't be trusted. And so these clones have to explain to them that they're not like the other the other clones. They didn't follow that order, and they don't see eye to eye with the Empire. And so, yeah, so we get to Kashyyyk. There's a huge battle between them and uh, between the Wookiees, the Bad Batch, and the Trandoshans who are working with the Empire to raise the planet. And, um, yeah, either way... We, we find out that there's these giant forest spiders that are really, really freaking insane. And if, you, if they think they're threatened, they will attack you. But we find out that um, they, in the battle with the Trandoshans, that they actually piss off the spiders just to take out some of the Trandoshans and any of the, the, the clone, the stormtroopers that they have with the Empire. So, but the other thing that I want to point out is I thought it was interesting that they had uh, started, they had repainted and rebadged the old Separatist tanks, the old uh, AATs, and, and badged them with the Empire's logo. So those are Imperial tanks now. But either way, um, I thought it was a really good episode. And it looks like Gunji is going to be learning what it's like to live with the Wookiees and learn their religion and stuff like that. And, of course, part of that that I thought was interesting, too, was we find out that the Wookiees believe that their planet belongs to the trees and that they're there just to help the trees. And apparently the trees communicate and have their own plans. And, yeah, uh, just a really interesting episode. Um, ended on a really good note. Uh, the the old lady Wookiee named Yana um, seems pretty cool. So, um, but she's their leader. Either way, uh, let me know what you think. I enjoyed it, and uh, I'll see you on the next one.